what's going on everybody welcome back to another uh, tutorial video for Roblox and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make basically a menu so let's get started um, first in the start of UI you want to press this plus button and add a screen UI that will basically be the holder for our UIs next press that button again but insert a frame and name this main menu there we go in main menu you want to do this again but add a text label as well as a text button but anyway name this test or whatever you want um actually don't name it test you want to name this like lab just name it name it label i guess and then oh sorry you want to add a text button which will be the play button and you want to name it play or start or whatever you're gonna have on your button so you want to change what it says on the button by going down here I'm gonna have it say play and then you also want to make it uh, you want to do the text scaled so it looks better here's our play button I can uh, this isn't gonna be like a full screen main menu if you want you can just change the size of the uh, the frame which is oh god <laughs> which is right here but uh, don't add this stuff yet like oh oh god pull this stuff into the workspace for now if you want to make this bigger this is basically my main menu screen um, you gotta like delete these and pull it down I guess I'll just do a full screen menu menu now that I think about it but pull this down like that much maybe a little more and then pull this up and then go into view tab get these back now you have a full screen main menu and then drag these back oh no drag those two back into your main menu now you can select where did it go wait what okay well i guess we're gonna be making a new play button <laughs> anyway so the label is gonna be basically showing our game name so I'm not gonna have that a full screen one though so you just want to change the transparency to 0.3 that works best for me I'm pretty sure oh wait no I need to go in the frame so go 0.3 for the frame there you go and then the test uh, for for that you wanna it's basically gonna be your game name so basically say like let's just say this is called menu test simulator there you go it's gonna say your game name in that little tab press text scale that's one of the options to make it like scaled to the size and then also you want to add your button back if that got lost too we set our button values okay here we go play text scale all right there we go. this is our button again let's try to find the middle of the screen there we go so we can change the um properties of this too i recommend my settings so they work they kind of work the best but all right so then you want to add a script to the play button and name this uh, menu script. Uh, okay. Then, um, this will be in the description. I, c I guess, like, I'm just being a little lazy here. Um, this is just in the description if you guys want to use it. Uh, I made it. So basically, um, this just basically makes it so when you click the play button, it disappears. And the other script that I was testing that I made I'm not sure if it works but it should highlight the text oh wait hold on this might be why because we don't have that yet hold on this might be why okay this this might work now okay transparent yep all right so let's save this let's publish it and there we go this should be our complete menu so, actually, I'm going to make this look a tiny bit better by making the transparent. 
can I get each one? There we go. And let's hop in, I guess. Play. Okay, whatever. All right, here we go. Yep. So basically, when we go over the play button with our mouse, it highlights it. You probably can't see my mouse, but I'm highlighting over it. So, uh, or I'm hovering over it, the play button. So when I hover over it, it basically highlights it, highlights the button to make it look a little better and more professional. So then when we click on the button, it goes like this. You can add sounds to click your button and everything, but that's just a simple way of making a main menu on Roblox Studio. If you enjoyed the video, um, please leave a like. I would appreciate it and subscribe if you want for more videos kind of like this, and I guess I'll see you guys later.